I'm now a stronger person than I ever have been in my entire life. Officer Taylor Nielsen's strength comes from a difficult journey that started more than a year ago. The evidence technician with the Lebanon Police Department was one of the officers who responded to this double murder scene in Zionsville back in February of 2016. Katie Gill and her four-year-old son, Ray, had been shot to death. In the months that followed, Nielsen became depressed and had nightmares. You know, I felt like there was no hope. I felt like I was not going to be able to get treated for this or find any help for it. In October, friends saved her as she was trying to take her own life. They ended up finding me in a field, and um, I remember one of them actually uh, reaching their hand out and saying it's going to be okay. Nielsen is being treated for PTSD. She and her family have learned talking about mental health struggles can be life-saving. When she stepped up and had the courage to speak out about her experiences, it just changed my life forever. Taylor's father, Mike Nielsen, is the Boone County Sheriff who was the commander at the murder scene in Zionsville. And the incident that took place back in uh, 2016, uh, February of 2016, uh, will forever be stuck in my mind. After helping his daughter get on the road to recovery, he too realized he suffers from PTSD and is getting treatment. It affects every everybody out there. And professions, it doesn't make any difference whether you're a student, whether you're a police officer, whether you're a teacher, or whether you're a nurse. We are affected by this mental health issues at some point in time in our life. I'm Officer Taylor Nielsen. I'm with the Lebanon Police Department. Together, they're on a mission to erase the stigmas associated with mental health issues, including supporting proposed federal legislation that would help other officers. Taylor says her message isn't just for members of law enforcement and their families, but it's for everyone especially parents and people who work with kids. You know, we have all of this education that we send our kids to, yet we never teach them how to just love themselves. And it's that could be one of the most powerful things and powerful moments in, in someone's life. She and her father want to help others recognize the signs of anxiety, stress, and PTSD. But there is help out there, and um, they can get that help, and that's really what we want them to know. Then sings my soul. Taylor says her journey is now one filled with faith, healing, and hope. I just think really sharing my faith testimony is, is a big purpose that God had for me. And that's one reason I think I'm still here today. From Boone County, Julie Persley, RTV6.